The seminal public school student First Amendment case is Tinker versus Des Moines Independent Community School District. The case involved the wearing of black peace armbands by John Tinker, his sister Mary Beth Tinker, and their friend Christopher Eckhart. The three students from Des Moines, Iowa, wore the black peace armbands as a form of political protest to protest U.S. involvement in the Vietnam War, to support Robert Kennedy's Christmas truce, and to mourn those who had died in the conflict. School officials, however, learned of the protest and quickly passed a no armband rule. They feared that the wearing of the black armbands was simply too controversial in the public schools. The case proceeded all the way to the United States Supreme Court. On February 24, 1969, the United States Supreme Court ruled 7-2 in favor of the public school students. Writing for the Supreme Court, Justice Abe Fortas wrote, it can hardly be argued that either students or teachers shed their constitutional rights to freedom of speech or expression at the schoolhouse gate. The court emphasized that the wearing of the black peace armbands was akin to pure speech, that it was a form of peaceful political expression, and that school officials could not selectively target a specific political viewpoint associated with a specific symbol. Furthermore, the United States Supreme Court established a very student speech protective standard, holding that public school officials cannot prohibit student speech unless they can reasonably forecast that that expression will cause a substantial disruption of school activities or invade the rights of others. The Tinker case remains the lodestar for determining student free speech rights in the public schools.